Changes could soon be coming to airports all over the country. New legislation introduced in Congress will mandate COVID restrictions for travelers this holiday season. Alex Capriello is live in L.A. with this story. Alex, what kind of regulations are being proposed? Well, good morning to you, Adrian. Yes, proposed is the right word there. This is not a law yet. This is just something that's on the table. Basically, what it would do is it would require all travelers that are traveling within the U.S. to either be vaccinated, have proof of a COVID-19 test, negative test, or to have fully recovered from COVID-19. Now, this comes as holiday travel is beginning to ramp up. What they're trying to do is they're trying to curb this outbreak. They want to make sure that the Department of Health and Human Services and the FAA are working together to come up with some national standards for all airline travelers. This comes from proposed legislation from Dianne Feinstein, who you know has quite a bit of weight in Congress. She said this is already building off of current standards for international travel. Anyone entering the U.S. from foreign countries must already show proof of a negative test to get in. Here's a quote from her. It only makes sense that we're also ensuring that millions of airline passengers that crisscross our country aren't contributing to further transmission, especially as young children remain ineligible to be vaccinated. Now, Adrian, you might recall it was at this time and entering into winter that cases really were surging. surging. That's after Thanksgiving and heading into those winter holidays. So that's the type of outbreak that these federal lawmakers are hoping to avoid this time around. All right, Alex, thank you so much for that. That would change travel forever, possibly. Thank you.